Welcome to Create Video Ebooks using Mac OS X Services. Well, what do we need to do first? Here's the setup. We assemble the text of our ebook in a plain text file. It should be UF UTF-8 encoded and have Unix line feeds. We then need to create or discover a cover image. 600 by 900 is a good ratio between width and height. Then we need to create or discover a video file. It has to be MPEG-4. Now let's see how we assemble all of this into an EPUB based ebook. Here we are with the materials we've collected. First we have our text file, then we have our cover image, and here we have a movie. We're going to try to put all of these together in an ebook. First thing we do is we invoke the services menu and choose create digital book from the selected files. What will happen next is that this will invoke a uh, user interface that will get from us the title of our ebook and the author and a name for the file to save it. And next we just point to the um, files that will constitute our cover and then point to the file that will be our media file and there we have a famous actor reciting a poem. And that's all there is to it. In the background, it's putting our ebook together, and there it is, right there on the desktop where we told it to be stored. So we just drag it onto the library pane of iTunes application, and it becomes part of our iTunes library, book library. Next, we just synchronize it to our I device. In this case, we have a, a, an iPad, and it will synchronize everything, including the ebook. And so it's all done. So, what did we just do? It all went by pretty, pretty quickly. We assembled the parts, cover image, a text file, or text files. Each text file becomes a separate chapter, and media, uh, MPEG-4 audio or video. We selected the text file, or files, we invoke the service, which is called Create Digital Book from the Selected Files. We added a title, author, and file name. We pointed to the cover image and the media files. Clicked on Continue. That created the EPUB file, and then we sideloaded it into the iTunes application. Finally, we synchronized it with our iPad or iPhone or iPod Touch, and that's it. Really quite simple. So, what does our ebook look like? Let's see. Here's the first page. You'll notice that it has text, and it also has a uh, video image, and we can click on that little start button, and we will see an actor. Um, and this actor is reciting a, the poem that we have uh, in text form below that. And if that's not big enough, we can click on it again. And you notice the little icon to the uh, lower right corner of the video. We can click on that and go full screen. There's full screen. And we can tap on that. And we can control the video even more. And scrub back and forth. We can 
uh, shrink it back to its original size or we can stop the video right there. Here's the second page and the last page um, and that finishes our little poem and that's our ebook. Quite simple, quite quick, and that's the end. Thanks for listening.